What's up, YouTube? It's your friend, Mother Back with another The Wolf Among Us video. Let's jump right into this. See if it left us. Continue. So, one faith. Wait. Hopefully, it's left off. Yeah, I think it did. Okay, and cool. we ended up going out the window, and I landed on Toad's car. You guys made a real mess. Yeah. Looks worse than the day. Yeah, right? Is somebody up there? Hey! What the hell is that? Wait here. Oh, we got another fight about to happen? I love the graphics Shit. on this. Nice car. <laughs> Poor Toad. Are we just gonna stand there and stare at each other? Come on. I'm sorry! That's enough, alright? Just shut it! Uh. Sounds like that Toad guy. Should probably get that fixed. Helen doesn't make this much of a mess. What's it say? Pay up? What does it say? I think it said pay up, fucker. Uh, well, anything else? What do we got here? What kind of asshole swings a lamp at a guy? <laughs> yeah, right. Where are you going? All right, we already did that. Examine. I think that's about it in here. I don't see nothing else. Alright, let's move on. Now who knows crying? That was like a girl. We'll have to play Captain Saberho again. Is that his son? Toads, I think. Be nice in there, okay? I'm always nice. Um. Hey, Toad, you in there? <laughs> Big B and Miss White. Surely you didn't come all this way just for my bother. Sorry, Big V. Weird it's looking thing. It's embarrassing to have to admit, but uh, I thought it was someone else in Woody's place. There wasn't, though. Uh, not when I checked. Nothing but a leaky drain pipe. Imagination must have got the best of me. So, you know, false alarm. Sorry for dragging Miss White into this, but thanks for coming. Much appreciated. We heard someone crying. Oh, the boy stubbed his toe on the bed frame is all. It stings, you know, but it's nothing to kick up a fuss about. A little tub swim, he'll be right as rain, I'm sure. Yeah, something here right here. Are you alright? Oh, he's fine, Miss White. Just stung his little toe. Better swimmer than Walker, just like his dad. Wanna... So, I guess you'll be taking off now. No need to hang around here anymore. He's in a hurry to I get mean, me I'm off. I'm sorry you came all the way here for nothing. But it was nothing, really. I'll leave when I'm ready, Toad. I just want to check things out first. The yeah, longer he's a you talk, the longer this takes. So just stand over there and shut all up. All right, all right. I just don't want to waste your time, is all. He's acting uh, suspicious. Have a, have a cup of tea, whatever you like. Whew. Grown ups. Am I right? Uh. Hey, you know what? Flycatcher said you had a pretty awesome insect collection. I'd really love to see it. Is it in your room? It has a weevil. Cool. Ooh. You old toad. For a game. 
Just mind the upholstery while you're looking for nothing. Yeah, sure thing. I'll smack the shit out of him. All right, what we got? Broken lamps. How'd this happen? Fucking hell. Damn thing must have fell off the table. Uh-huh. Just, just fell off the table. All the boy was faffing about, playing salts and salt fish. Who knows with the lad? Uh... Yeah, something's going on here. Oh, wait a minute. I want to look around before I talk to him. We got blood. You bleeding? Why? You say it's blood. Still fresh. Oh, well, I cut me end. Ran around like a tit trying to pick out a wrap. Must have got some on the furnishments. Lamp in pieces, blood on the wall. It's awful, I know. Sounds painful. Oi! Don't you go mother-ending now. The wound didn't sit very long, you know. Perks of being a fable, I suppose. <laughs> and a frog. Hmm. What the hell's going on here? Somebody's trying to get out the window? Wait a minute. What is it now? If it's blood, you know what happened. No, I... there's marks here on the window, so. And what's that about? No real reason. Just last night, when I'd come out, I was in a, a downright dizzy, mate, as you would be. And <laughs> I plum forgot the keys to this place. And I had to climb in through the bloody window. Really? Scared Junior off to death. Hmm. Yeah, something's going on here. Let's... What's this? Oh yeah, something's definitely going on. And what happened here? The poker? What of it? There's more blood on the tip. Did this happen before or after you came in the window? After, after. Oh, I was I was poking the coals and it slipped a bit. Sliced up in my foot like a seashell. But like a shit ugly thing. If you're gonna say something, out with it. It's been the hottest summer in years, Toad, so why would you be making a fire? Yeah, Stay right. in this place for more than a spell, and a drought will make you think you're in a sodding tantra. I, I look it out, so what's the fuss? I thought toads can dry out. No, mate, you're thinking of lizards. Yeah, this toad's full of shit. Something's going on here. Oh my god, will you not make a big faff out of this? There's nothing <laughs> to solve here, Sheriff. I'm telling you everything that happened. Why don't you believe me? That blood's at about his height, too. I mean, things happen, you know. I think maybe you're hiding something. Hiding something? Maybe. But, uh, to tell you the truth, I don't know yet. But I know you're lying about something. But I'm not... And you're just gonna make it worse for yourself the longer you keep up the act. I'm not bullshitting you. Honest. We'll see. I'll keep on pushing him. Something ain't right here. Uh, what we got here? That more blood? No, just a clean space in the dust. Did you move something? Ah, uh, maybe one of Junior's toys or something. I mean, who knows? Wait a minute. Okay, Sheriff. Now what? Give me a second. That broken lamp used to be here, right? Just tell me what happened. Nothing happened, mate. Nothing! And why did the lamp have to be there? Of all the blooming pointless inquiries. It's my own place. Don't you think I'll know what happens in it? Because the lamp was always over here, Toad. It was over here, 
and now it's there. You're lying the space in the shit. dust is from where you well, moved I did it. some refiguring. Who fucking cares? Bloody hell, mate. Come on, get off with this. No, not yet. I ain't letting you off yet. Let's see if there's anything else in here. And why is the lock busted? Eh? The lock. It looks like somebody kicked in the door. A spot of dust and a broken lock. What are you getting at, mate? Oh, for Christ's sake, a fucking lock's been busted for weeks, mate. Wait a minute. He said he had coming through the window because he forgot his keys. He, this guy's full of shit. Bloody hell, Bigby. What sinister bit have you uncovered this time? I left the tap water running? Didn't stop the recycling? What's the point of all this, mate? Really? Why'd you climb in through the window, then? Gotcha. Well, why'd you climb in through the window? Gotcha. You said it yourself. The lock's been rotten for weeks. You wouldn't have needed a key to get in. Fucking hell. Just what are you on about, mate? After the state I was in, I didn't have me head. That's all it was. I forgot a fucking handle was fucking busted. And I'll tell you what else. It's embarrassing you bringing all this shit up, all right? So quit it with a third degree and all that. Bigby, come on. I'm begging for mercy over here, old boy. I was looking forward to a nice afternoon. Just me and me son, and you've taken up enough of a day with all this... this sniffing around at me private belongings. You the fuck when I called me? I'm sorry I called. Really, I am. But will you please... please just bugger off? Not yet. Not yet, you say to my face that you think I'm hiding something from you. I do. You've had the guy of the room for a fair bit of time now. Nothing's here. So when? When are you gonna leave? I mean, I feel like I'm on trial here. In my own bloody home. It's not seemly. When? When you start telling me the truth, Toad. Well, I've told you the truth, mate. Jesus Christ, what more do you want? There you have it. <laughs> this is all getting a bit stressful, all right? I have my limit for bullshit, Toad. And I think we reached it ten minutes ago. Now, Dad! you're gonna tell me what's going on here, or I'm gonna start... Dad! Oh, poor kid. Pigby, is this really necessary? Yes, it is. Oh, he's hiding something. Either something he knows or something he's kept, but I won't play any more games with him. Dad? Oh my god. Oh, uh, was he the one that attacked? Hat. Somebody attacked him. Bigby, you didn't. He didn't. It was that butcher, a, a Tweedle, Dame or D. Ah. Strip them down to their Johnnies before you can tell which is which. He come bulging in, screaming about something the woodsman had. Or thought he had, I don't know. He tore up the place, beat me up when I said I didn't have it. I tried to go out the window, but he pulled me back in. What was he looking for? I don't have a fucking clue, Sheriff. I would have told you. I yeah, to sure you would have. I did. But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill my boy. I was fucked tried up. to give the bastard a coat. He wouldn't take it. Whose coat? The girl. Dad borrows things from people who live here. Steals. <laughs> uh, sometimes. Borrows. I don't steal nothing. Turn around here would astonish you, mate. I we'll merely repossess what's been left behind. Well, we'll be taking cut. the coat now. <laughs> if she has next of kin, family, anyone. All right. Fetch him the fur. Fine bit of dress it is. I really like how they did this. This is good. Oh, what the hell kind of coat is that? Who the hell would wear that? Outside. Wait. It's an envelope. Fucking hell, of course there is. For my luck, it's a map to some bloody doubloons. It's addressed to Prince Lawrence. Do you want to try and give it to him, or...? Let's open it. I'm sorry, Faith. What could she have been sorry for? Hooker and her know. prince. But maybe Lawrence does. 
Well, it's been quite a surprising day for all of us, hasn't it? I'd see you out, but I'm afraid of dripping any more blood in the place. Uh, I guess that's it here. It was very nice talking to you, TJ. Thanks. Poor little kid. Uh, see ya. See his daddy get beat up. I'll be honest, Bigby. I don't really know how to feel about what happened in there. We got what we came for. Some information. It'll be all right. Sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. So, the prince is now? Lawrence is. Yeah. It's our best lead. So we're gonna go see a prince? Really. When he put a prince and a hooker, okay. Maybe she has some dirt on him. South Bronx, early morning. I don't want to stay here any longer than we have to, so let's just pick an approach and stick to it, okay? Just humor me. When the magic mirror showed me this apartment, I think I saw a knife inside, covered in what looked like blood. I wasn't expecting that. Yeah. Well, like I said, let's not overcomplicate things. You can question him while I look around for it. And if he objects? We're here on official Fabletown business, and we can be persuasive if necessary. Or you can. Yeah, right? All right, what we got here? Maybe it ain't the type of prince I'm thinking. Cause this is a shithole place. Anything else? Alright, let's go interrogate this guy. Don't that, just blood? peep into someone's house. Check if he's home. Can you hear me? <laughs> Are you okay? Hey, answer me! How many different replies are gonna be? Damn it. Okay, it ran out. Alright, um. Oh, this ain't good. Doors open. There's blood on the floor. <laughs> oh, someone's dead. Is that the prince guy? The color keep on shifting. Go get Dr. Swinehart. I'll stay with you. No! Him. No! Let me go. She. What is it that you're telling us? Bigby, water. Kitchen. I said Walter. Uh, now the kitchen. Controls are wonky. Why does the lights keep on dimming and fading out? Pay the rent next week. Pizza in the fridge, please look. Don't look for me. Did you find it yet? Yep, comment. Hold on. If you have something to ask him, you should do it now. Yeah, he ain't gonna make it. Who did this to you? <laughs> Faith. Did he just say faith? I thought he said faith. 
Yep, that's it for him. Do you still have that letter? Yes. It's only two words, but he died without seeing them. I'm sorry. So he's saying the hooker killed him. We need to figure out what happened here and find whoever did this. Okay, maybe it wasn't her. All right, let's go investigate. It's sharp. There's blood on the blade. Is that the same knife you saw in the mirror? Yeah. I don't know why it's over here. Yeah, he's over there. I just don't understand. Why would someone want to kill him? All right, what else we got? More blood. Strange. Hard edge to this pool, like something was here and got moved. Alright, let's pick that up. Fresh. Still a little sticky. Uh, is that... When do that, you think that was taken? Is that the hooker girl? Before all this. Bullet passed through the chair. Yeah. The angle works if he shot himself. Can I pull it out? What else we got? All right, nothing there. All right, let's go see. Uh, the dead, the dead. Go back here. Anything here? Bookcase. Secondhand paperbacks. Old encyclopedias. Anything ain't Dusty. good here? No one's read these in a while. All right, let's go check out the kitchen. What are we already looked at? Already looked at that. Got everything over here. I don't think I'd go back this way more. Oh, yes. Closet. Anything in here? Oh, shit! You son of a bitch! Stay here! Okay, that got me. No! Damn, that was loud. Hey! Stop! Leave me alone! Oh, shit. You missed. You missed again. Be quicker. You win that one. Ah, wrong button. Damn it. Upstairs. Hey, I keep on pushing the wrong trigger, damn it. <laughs> hey. 
Gotcha. We go fight. Ease up, Bigby. We're on the same side here. You son of a bitch. Make me run after you. Who are you? What? Who are you? Listen, man. I'm a private investigator. A man's dead. I know how it looks, but I had nothing to do with that. Bullshit. You're covered in blood. Look, I was just asking him about the girl. That's all. When I mentioned her being dead, he freaked out. I figured someone had told him. How was I supposed to know? Shit. Fucker shot himself right in front of me. I couldn't stop him, man. Oh, he shot himself? You're looking for the woodsman, right? I know where he is. My guy says he's holed up at the trip trap. We can go over there right now, the both of us. My employer's looking to ask him a few questions, too. What were you doing back there? Checking out the guy who was married to the girl. Seemed a good place to start. Tracking down... leads. What kind of leads? Oh, I can't tell you that. It's confidential. Sorry. Sure you understand? Nope. Can't say that I do. <laughs> Come on, you're coming with me. This could have been easy. <laughs> what do you mean worry. by that? It still is. Come on. Dumb. Dumb? Yeah, it is. Look, it'd be much easier for you no, to... No, I'm D. He's dumb. Oh, Ooh. shit! Knocked me this straight out. You almost looked peaceful. <laughs> I'm out cold. Yep. Except you're lying in a dirty alley. Yep. With an open wound on the back of your head. Yep. Uh, what happened? A well, sucker punch. The one guy hit you, then the other one started kicking you. Have to kick their asses. Rib. Then they jumped into a car and drove off. Come on, get up. Guess we're out of options. He mentioned the trip trap. Then that's where we'll go. I'll call a cab. Panic in the parlor is achievement. Every time I think I'm getting a handle on what's going on, things just get more complicated. It feels like we're always a step behind. The woodsman is the only lead we've got, and he was one of the last people to see Faith alive. Getting some answers out of him will start to clear things up. I hope you're right. Bigby? Be honest with me. Who do you think... did this? Don't know yet. I know it's still early, but I just feel a step behind. Faith was in trouble, afraid of someone. I need to find out who might be whoever she was working for. There's still a lot of questions. A lot. You find the woodsman, figure out what he knows, then go from there. Makes sense. That's probably the best approach. Thanks I wish you. there was... Are we having a moment? Sorry. Go ahead. I didn't mean to cut you off. No, it's... We're gonna make out in back of the cab? It's nothing. I just... Seeing all this today... There are fables that are struggling worse than I'd imagined. We pay so much attention to the residents of the woodlands. You forget there's a whole community out there to serve. To have to turn to... Prostitution. I... I Rough wish life. there was more we could do. This isn't how I thought it would be. But Crane runs things his own way. You're doing your best. It's all anyone can do. Obviously you don't know what I do all day. Right now, I'm the gatekeeper. 
making sure none of these disenfranchised folks are, as he puts it, wasting his time. You'll fix it. I don't know. It's just a broken system. The fables who walk in through the back door like Bluebeard, we have all the time in the world for them. You try and come in through the front door, through the proper channels, asking for anything, needing help. Well, I turn you away. Sounds a lot about like our immigration problem here in the United States. Now things are worse off than they've ever been. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse, but not by much. Maybe this isn't for me. I thought public service was pure. You'll figure it out. You're better than I am with this political stuff. Well, that's not saying much. I trust you to make the right decision. I hope you're right. Yeah, maybe you should handle this one. Lovely area. Yeah, maybe I should. Big B. I um, say it. Spit it be out. Careful, please. She got feelings for me. I see it. The same goes for you. I will. Yeah, we go hook up. Trying to do good for the community. I got a feeling all hell's gonna break loose here. The trip trap bar. Well, hello. What do you want, Sheriff? I'm looking for the woodsman. Well, he's not here. So I guess you can go now. Oh, this is the same chick from last episode. Look, I'm not even gonna ask where he is now, okay? I just wanna know the last time he was here. That's all. Who? I'm being nuts. So try again. He hasn't been here for a few weeks. Why she keep on staring at no, him? No, maybe. I don't know. But yeah, he hasn't been here in a while, if he's been here at all, which... Uh, I don't know. I'd just like some help, and I'll be out of here. Well, I'd be willing to help you out of here. Would that help? I bet you will. <laughs> well, she's a smartass. Alright, well, I'm going to end this video here. Yeah, storyline, uh, curious to see where it takes us, uh... I have no clue who the killer is right now. Uh, something's fishy with this guy right here. I guess we'll find out next episode. But anyway, thank you for watching. I'll catch you guys next video. Peace.